November 19th, the day of the Reformer. Filled with a revolutionary spirit, those born on November 19th generally build from a starting point of change. It is not enough, however, for them to simply rebel. Reformers, they must carefully craft something new to take the place of the old, and furthermore administer to it. Thus they are an interesting blend of radical and conservative, anarchy and establishment. Themes of control or even repression can figure prominently in their lives whether they are rebelling against such forces or themselves exercising it. You care about power balance and where it belongs and who should hold the majority and how they should use it, namely yourself. You like to think that your way is the right way and you often come into conflict with those who disagree with you. Keep yourself open to criticism, though. This will help you to be a better person. You have a huge amount of self-confidence, but that is a strength and a weakness. On one hand, you can tackle anything, but in your arrogance and with your hubris, your whole world can come crashing down if you don't manage it well, I mean, really. Anyway, your strengths are that you're contemporary, convincing and constructive. But your weakness is that you're preoccupied, overconfident and resistant. November 19th, I'm not mad. Look, I'm not mad, I'm jealous, is what I am. You guys get to eat whatever you want, whenever you want. And it's not even that bad for you. Look, your health can improve if your diet is a little more balanced, but isn't that the case with everyone? You're just like so active and hyper and good stuff that you can just shovel it back and you, all your activities, you're gonna be fine. You're just gonna, gonna work it off, gonna have a great, 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 great time. Vigorous exercise is recommended for you, though. Uh, I have a list of certain sports that will be uh, here helping you out. There's running, running or jogging, just motion in some form. Uh, aerobics, because you know, we're back in the 80s, uh, tennis, racquetball, or squash, if you're not American, uh, and other competitive one-on-one -on -one sports, like fencing. Ooh, interesting. I threw that one at you. That's not in the book. Mm. In silence, the truth can at last speak.